Welcome back to Science Click. Today, Einstein's gravity. In the 17th century, Newton discovers universal gravitation. With this, he manages to predict the movement of an apple falling from a tree, or the orbit of the moon around the Earth. However, Newton does not manage to explain why gravity exists, nor how it acts. To answer these questions, it is necessary to wait for the early 20th century, with Albert Einstein's theory of general relativity. For Einstein, the three dimensions of space in which we move and time in which we evolve are just two parts of a same thing, space-time. In space-time, objects exist in a given place, at a given time. Now, let us try to conceptualize space-time as a grid on which we could place an object A. When A is placed on this grid, it distorts it according to its mass. The more massive the object, the more it will distort space-time. Inversely, the less massive, the less space-time will be disturbed. Now let's imagine that we place a second object B on this grid. B distorts space-time as well, since it possesses a mass, but less than A, since its mass is not as great. Let's now look at what happens if we release a marble in a bowl. Because of the bowl's curvature, the marble will slide along the inside of it until it comes to rest at the centre. In a similar way, when we think about space-time, in distorting the grid, A creates a sort of bowl around itself. Consequently, just like a marble, B will slide along this bowl, gradually edging closer to A. If we look at this scene from above, we observe that B is attracted by A, just like with Newton's model of gravity. Now, if we were to release B in this bowl with a certain speed, it would go around the bowl while getting closer to A. Finally, if we could release B with a sufficiently great speed, B would begin to go around A without ever getting closer to it. It is in this way that planets orbit around the Sun. Just like with Newton, Einstein's theory predicts the movement of planets around the Sun. However, being more thorough, this theory has also enabled the discovery of many other scientific novelties, like the fact that a very important density can lead to the appearance of what we call a black hole.